Hey everybody, welcome to Kimmel's Irish Pub. Time for another movie review. Tonight's movie, Eileen. I heard of this, uh, I think on TikTok. They say it's pretty good. There's, there's another movie with a, one lady's name in it. I forget what it was, but he said, if you like that one, you're going to like this one. I don't remember if I like that one. But anyway, this is about a woman and her friendship with somebody at a prison facility, a co-worker, and it takes a sinister turn. That's all we know, right? just came out um, on streaming today, Amazon Prime. Um, but uh, Thomason McKenzie, um, Shay Win Wingham, he's pretty good too. And the most popular one is in here somewhere. There she is, Anne Hathaway. So I don't know, 6.6 .6 on IMDb, so that's pretty solid. Um, you know, not, without being a blockbuster, but 2,910 people rated so far. Hour and 37 minutes long. So we'll see. Stick around, I'll let you know what I think. Hey everybody, we're at the credits of Eileen, and I have to say, wow, I guess is the first thing that comes to mind for me. Um, uh, for Really quick, I think, the, the girl I had mentioned earlier, she is, I, she's, I see her in a lot of different things, right? Her, her uh, Thomason, Thomason McKenzie, she plays this type of role perfectly. Um, so she is a young woman, 24 years old lives at home with her father, who's played by Shane Wingham, um, but works at the prison, right? And that's where she meets um, Anne Hathaway, who comes in as like, it's like the warden, or maybe the psychologist, I don't know. Uh, you don't get enough of that, um, and that's the problem. So that there's your three main characters, that's all you need to know. I mean, there are other people in the movie that I recognize, but, you know, they, they, there's not a lot to them either. There's not a lot to the main characters. Um, there's a little bit of development between uh, Thomason and um, Shay's character, father-daughter there, a um, little bit more, but otherwise it's it's missing that. And I went into this, I'm watching it, and it, it starts off interesting, but you don't know where it's going. Uh, essentially, uh, as I mentioned, her character works at a prison, and um, uh, what's her name? <laughs> I already forget her name. I just Anne Hathaway. Thank you. I better keep that up. Anne Hathaway's character comes into the prison, new, uh, but kind of the leader of the prison. I don't think she was the warden. It doesn't matter, but um, her and Thomason's character, you know, start to develop a little bit of a relationship, right? Um, so they spend a little, little bit of time of that, like one night, they go out to the bar and have a few drinks. So, but then, you know, they lead you to believe that there's a really strong connection between the two of them, although it's just one night. So, you, you know, uh, close to feeling it, but I think they should have spent some more time there on that, but whatever, that's besides the point, because then they jump to the fact of her father-daughter relationship, right? So how's her father with her? Shay Wingham's character, who's like a drunk because their mother died, right? And so she's like taking care of him and all of this kind of stuff, but but earning for something more and a friendship with Anne Hathaway, right? So that all, that everything that I just told you takes the first hour, hour and 10 minutes, really. Um, there's that's the development there you, and I don't know it still even feels a little slighted on the Anne Hathaway side father daughter perfect great thank you okay and now I will say I did check a couple of other reviews and people say it's missing a third act or somebody said I think it's missing a second act I think that's your first act then the second act a little bit more and then the third act. I don't know it's missing I don't know what acts or whatever. It is missing something, right? So you got that first hour and 10 minutes, and I will say I was also on my phone quite a bit. But at the 110 mark-ish, 110 to 115, I don't know, right around there, you know, make it to that. And it really gets, okay, put the phone down, <laughs> you know what I mean? Pause TikTok for a second, let's get into this, right? And you don't miss anything by being on your phone, but... Um, uh, if you just listen to the first part of my review, you know what's going on. And it gets to this point, and it's like, whoa, okay, you know. But there's only 20 minutes left in the film. And so, and then 20 minutes later, it ends. Which is okay, but it really only gave me 20 minutes of enjoyment. 19 minutes of enjoyment, because at the 20th minute, I was like, what? You know, it's, it's missing so much. So, I think there's some pieces there that you can put together and this would have been really cool um, 
but I just don't think they landed. It felt like they ran out of time, money, or something, and just decided to go this one direction, and that was it. And it's like, huh, right? I mean, I get parts of the way it ended, but not all of it. So I have to talk a little bit more about that. So, you know what I mean? So this one, ah, wants to be a great movie, bores you for an hour and ten minutes, excites you, and then shuts it off. <laughs> so that's what I got for you. And, and But great acting. I, I think Anne Hathaway was good, too. Um, not that she was never a bad actress. I'm pretty sure she was pretty good. Um, but Thomasin McKenzie was phenomenal. She's really good at her craft. She plays that strange kind of person really, really well, I think. So, anyway, before I, I leave you, I do want to say a little bit of spoiler alert. So, if you if you haven't seen it yet, and it's interesting, go see it. If you haven't seen it yet, you don't want to hear more about it. Spoiler alert, spoiler alert, spoiler alert. Alright, so, with that all being said, we get to the ending, right? And just parking the car and leaving? Like, come on. Like, I, I get the whole, okay, Anne Hathaway just basically ditched her. Got it. I'm on board. I like that. There's so many directions you can still go. You know, you could still set up your father. You could go back after Anne Hathaway. Go back to that. Uh, you know, there's all different kinds of things. Or you could do something by, you know, getting rid of, you know, the evidence and all that stuff and, and taking care of it. You just park the car somewhere and leave it running? Like, that's gonna come right back to you. And, and go missing? Like, and smiling like you just won the lottery. Like, it was like, there's no, I mean, I'm okay with the fact that, hey, she's finally getting away, she's getting out, love it all, but it just doesn't work. Not that piece of it. Like it's, you gotta do something a little bit more to, to if she wants to ride off into the sunset with a trucker. Okay, if that's what you want your final scene to be, there's other ways to do that. And I, I think they just failed on that part, but, um, I don't know. I don't know if it's really worth watching. Um, I, honestly, you could. I, I really think that if you just did that. I mean, the, the story, the only other piece that you missed besides my lead up for the hour and ten minutes is the story of the boy in the prison, in the boy's prison or whatever it is. You know, you're, you're curious as what the, what's going on with the mother and stuff like that. Well, at that point, you figure that out, right? So you know what's going on. So that's the only piece. Otherwise, I'd say just watch the hour and just listen to it my synopsis and then watch it from an hour and ten forward but you can't do that so all right that's it that's all i got i had to jump in with the spoiler because i was just disappointed in that they could have done something i didn't think it wasn't going to blow the top off but they could have not angered me so that's always important all right that's it i don't know if i was helpful but i appreciate you tuning in kimmel's irish pub